an interview in PHP. Best he answered. Raj is having well hands-on experience in PHP, he is getting into PHP technical interview round. Interviewer started by asking. What are different areas, where PHP can be used? There are three main areas where PHP scripts are used. Number one, server-side scripting, PHP run on the web server, with a connected PHP installation. You can access the PHP program output with a web browser. Number two, command line scripting, PHP script will also run without any server or browser, with help of PHP parser. Number three, writing desktop applications, PHP can also be used to create a desktop application with a graphical user interface. We can use PHP GTK to write such programs. Explain file handling in PHP, and all their different operation like, reading, writing updating etc., in detail. PHP has several functions for creating, reading, open and closing and editing files. PHP read file function, the read file function reads a file and writes it to the output buffer. Example is given below. PHP open file function f open. A better method to open files is with the f open function. This function gives you more options than the read file function. Example is given below. PHP read file, f read. The f read function reads from an open file. The first parameter of f read contains the name of the file to read from, and the second parameter specifies the maximum number of bytes to read. Example is given below. PHP close file, f close. The f close function is used to close an open file. Example is given below. PHP read single line, f gets. The f gets function is used to read a single line from a file. Example is given below. PHP check end of file, fe of. The fe of function checks if the end of file has been reached. Example is given below. PHP read single character, f get c. The f get c function is used to read a single character from a file. Example is given below. PHP write to file, F write. The F write function is used to write to a file. Example is given below. What's the difference between MySQL Connect and MySQL P Connect? MySQL Connect, open a connection to a MySQL server. Connection will be closed as soon as the execution of the script ends, unless it's closed earlier by explicitly calling MySQL close. Example is given below. MySQL Connect, open a connection to a MySQL server. Connection will be closed as soon as the execution of the script ends, unless it's closed earlier by explicitly calling MySQL close. Example is given below. Explain PHP MySQL functions, MySQL fetch array. MySQL fetch association, MySQL fetch row, MySQL fetch object and their differences. MySQL fetch array, fetch a result row as an associative array, a numeric array, or both. Example is given below. MySQL fetch association, fetch a result row as an associative array. Example is given below. MySQL fetch row, fetches one row of data from the result, associated with the specified result identifier. The row is returned as an array. Example is given below. 
My SQL fetch object, fetch a result row as an object, example is given below. What is difference between cookies and session? Explain both. A cookie is a small piece of text stored on a user's computer, by their browser. Each time the user's web browser interacts with a web server, it will pass the cookie information to the web server. Only the cookies stored by the browser, that relate to the domain in the requested URL will be sent to the server. This means that cookies that relate to example.com, will not be sent to exampledomain.com. Common uses for cookies are authentication, storing of site preferences, shopping cart items and server session identification. A session can be defined as a server-side storage of information, that is desired to persist throughout the user's interaction, with the website or web application. Instead of storing large and constantly changing information via cookies in the user's browser, only a unique identifier is stored on the client side, called a session ID, SSID. This session ID is passed to the web server every time the browser makes an HTTP request, that is a page link or AJAX request. The web application pairs the session ID with its internal database, and retrieves stored variables for use, by the requested page. What is SQL injection and how it can be prevented? SQL injection is the placement of malicious code in SQL statements, via web page input. SQL injection is one of the most common web hacking techniques. For example the original purpose of the below code was to create an SQL statement, to select a user, with a given user ID. If there is nothing to prevent a user from entering wrong input, the user can enter some smart input like this. Then, the SQL statement will look like this. The SQL above is valid and will return all rows from the user's table. A hacker might get access to all the user detail, that will be very dangerous. SQL injection can prevent it by using Number 1. MySQLI real escape string. The MySQLI real escape string function escapes special characters in a string for use in an SQL statement. Another way preventing SQL injection is by using Using prepared statement. Example is given below. What is cross-site scripting? Cross-site scripting XSS, attacks are a type of injection, in which malicious scripts are injected into trusted websites. Example is given below. The end user's browser has no way to know that the script should not be trusted, and will execute the script, because it thinks the script came from a trusted source, the malicious script can access any cookies, session tokens, or other sensitive information retained by the browser and passes to attacker. These scripts can even rewrite the content of the HTML page. Example is given below. Explain REST services. REST defines a set of architectural principles, by which you can design web services, that focus on a system's resources, including how resource states are addressed, and transferred over HTTP, by a wide range of clients, written in different languages. REST Web Service follows four basic design principles. Use HTTP methods explicitly. Be stateless. Expose directory structure like URIS. Transfer XML. JSON, or both. Explain SOAP. SOAP stands for Simple Object Access Protocol. SOAP provides the envelope, for sending web services messages over the internet. 
it is part of the set of standards specified by the W3C. The SOAP envelope contains two parts. One is, an optional header, providing information on authentication, encoding of data, or how a recipient of a SOAP message should process the message. The other is the body, that contains the message. These messages can be defined using the WSDL specification. What is difference between include and require? With the include or require statement, we use to insert the content of one PHP or HTML file into another PHP file before the server executes it. In include, if source file missing it'll give warning and continue execution, while in require, if source file missing it'll give error, and halt execution. Explain, session set save handler. To maintain the session data, we can use, session set save handler function. Syntax is given below. This function provides six callback functions which call automatically. Open function, will be called automatically when session start. Close function, will be called automatically when session end. Read function, will be called automatically when you read the session. Write function, will be called automatically when you write in the session. Destroy function, will be called automatically when you destroy in the session. GC function, will be called automatically when session inactive for a long time. How to convert string to array, an array to string in PHP. Explode convert string to array, example given below. Implode convert array to string, example given below. How to scrape the data from website using curl. To scrap the data from website, website must be public and open for scrapable. In the blow code, just update the curl opt URL, to which website's data you want to scrap. How to explode a string using multiple delimiters. To explode a string with multiple delimiters, we use preg split. Example is given below. Raj replied to all question very well. 